Let's write the decimal 0.98 as a fraction. So the first thing we want to do, let's call it 0.98 over 1. It's still 0.98. We're just dividing by 1. It doesn't change the value. But now we have the start of a fraction. What we need to do is get this to a whole number. And to get this to a whole number, I see I have one two decimal places. If we have two decimal places, we can multiply by 100. So let's multiply 100 times 0 0.98, and we end up with 98. So we have our whole number. But we can't just multiply the numerator by 100. We also have to multiply the denominator by 100. That's because 100 divided by 100 is 1. So we're multiplying by 1 doesn't change the value, just the way we represent it here. So 100 times 1, that's 100. And now we have a fraction, 98 over 100. But we can simplify this a little bit further. Let's give ourselves some room. Since they're both even numbers, let's divide them by 2. So 98 divided by 2, that's 49. And then 100 divided by 2, that's 50. So we can simplify 98 one hundredths down to 49 fiftieths. And we can't simplify this any further. So the decimal 0 0.98, you could write it as 98 over 100 or 49 over 50. And these are all equivalent. If you divide 49 by 50 or 98 by 100, you'll get 0 0.98. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.